it certainly seems evident that there, there was a concerted effort to create underground structures and to potentially move large populations of people into what are effectively underground cities that we can find all around the world. Darren Kuyu in the Cappadocia region of Turkey is a great example. That's a massive underground installation that could have housed tens of thousands of people. It's a little known fact, but there are miles and miles of tunnels and chambers beneath places like Saqqara, Egypt, also at Giza. I've had the chance to explore some of these myself, and I can tell you that there is just extensive underground work that also happened in places like Egypt. One thing we know for sure about South America is that it was intensely affected by the Younger Dries. In some places, almost 80% of megafauna died off in South America. There was tremendous climate change that occurred during the Younger Dryas. So at some point, it definitely seems like there was a, a real effort to move underground, potentially to protect themselves from what was happening on the surface or protect themselves from the sun. We don't really know, but at some point there was a, a real effort to, to go underground and to get away from whatever was happening on the surface of the planet.